Hello there, welcome back to some more Pit Mario the Thousand Year Door. Before we get started with the end of the game, which I want to do, first... Oh! Congrats, you cooking connoisseur. Congratulations, you've learned all the Zesty's recipes. Our menu is now complete, so your meals can be mighty tasty and mighty mighty too. As proof of your efforts, we sent you a special award, the cooking trophy. Check your useful items to admire it yourself or show it off to your friends. You've earned the right to bag. Yeah. Wonderful. Right. I'm going to farm up. Because I think I'm actually going to need some more items. So what I want to do... Is trade in my winnings for... The money money badge, which is 450 Pianta coins. I could play the slot machine until I get 450 Pianta coins. But I'm worried that I'm going to fuck that up. So... Instead, I'm going to check all the things I don't have. I don't have the money money badge. I don't have refund, so I need to get that. So in total, I need 510 because I want both things I haven't gotten yet. So let me just play the tube game until I get 510. So rather than make you watch me do this, I'm just going to fast forward, you know, 3000% and play some music in the background while I do it. Have fun. That only took me about 22 minutes, so not really that long. Um, but then again, I have just cooked food for two hours, so maybe by comparison, 20 minutes doesn't feel so long. Right. Hello. I'd like to trade in... Oh, shit. Sorry. I'd definitely like to trade in my winnings, please. Could I buy a refund badge? Yes. Could I buy a money money badge, please? No, thank you. I'm good. Right. So with that, I can now uh, equip... Well, have more money, basically. I need five. Where can I get five from? I don't want to get rid of my defense pluses, you see. I can take a hit of five um, FP. I guess I can give myself charge. I don't have any HP plus badges on, do I? I do. I want to get rid of that too. I want to. I want to give it. Make make it so that I am just the actual stats that I am. a flower finder on because then I can spam more moves. I want to make myself a natty 50-50, you know? So yeah, now I'm going to play for an extra half an hour. Um, as normal, because that shouldn't count for the whole video. Uh, yeah, I guess this way is fine. And then afterwards, we're going to explore what we haven't seen yet in terms of tattle logs and stuff. But that can be done after I've beaten the game. It's no problem. Basically, I've done enough side stuff I want to actually see 
new stuff. Got an extra star point, it's fine. Let me get more money for the fight anyway. Don't think this counts. No, you still only get one for that. Okay. Let's go into the door. Hello there. Me? I'm just getting in the way. I'll wait here and I'll watch the door. Yes, that's it. It's all up to you, Mario. Stop their foul ambitions and save Princess Peach. Uh, yes. Frankly. Oh. Chapter 8. The Thousand Year Door. Welcome to the Palace of Shadow. Ugh, oh, this place is freaky, but we don't have a choice, Mario. We've got to get in there and save Peach before this gets out of hand. Come on, Mario. Yes. Just make sure I didn't take off ice power, did I? Why? No reason. Don't worry about it. Okay. I don't think there's there's no more star pieces anyway, but there could still be hidden blocks and things, so I should still check. Any items I pick up, I'm going to need to use. You see, there's something here, apparently. Yeah, these guys aren't a threat to me. But I should still let them hit me in case there's new enemies here. There wasn't in that fight. Wasn't in that fight either, but hey ho. Getting lots of cash. That's good. And a shooting star I'll use on some enemies. Next door. Well, no shit, Sherlock. I mean, obviously, this is here. Okay, nothing else. Good. Let us engage the enemy. Still nothing new yet, but it's coming. New stuff's always on the horizon. Let's go. Okay, another start point for me. I shall fight everything. And another one. Spike pouch, okay. I don't actually think I want that, so I'm just going to toss it on the ground straight away. As soon as I can. Or use it in the battle, I guess, even if I don't need it. Right, these guys I do need to let hit me. I need to scan them. That's a boom shell, a bombshell build. These things are repeatedly shot out of bombshell build blasters. HP 6, 
Max HP is 3, attack is 6, defense is 2. His attack is high, but its HP is low, so you take out before it takes you out. Then again, if you focus on these guys, you'll never win. Smack that bombshell, build blaster. You guys are sheep. Get out of here. Give me one star point. Wonderful, you're actually worth killing. Okay. That's a bombshell build blaster. It fires bombshell builds. Makes sense, right? Max is 10 and defense is 4. It's really, really tough. Yeah, hard to hurt this guy. Thing is, if you don't take it out, keep shooting bombshell builds at you. If you've got to figure out how to beat it in fast. Yeah, no worries. I got this. Turn it's dead. In fact, you're both dead. Good. There we go. Next room. All or nothing badge. Boost attack by properly executing action rounds drops to zero. Fail. Let's see what you've got. Maybe you have a different enemy in you. I don't know. It didn't, but he's still worth one star point, so I don't really care. Face me. In combat, you fool. Dead. You're not worth worrying about, but yes, I still have to kill you. You cannot be suffered to live. Okay. Save point. I see you get no, I'm joking. Let's keep going. Blue sheet. I actually do want that. Let's get rid of this spike pouch. I don't want. I think I need to. Twenty coins, sure, I'll replenish. I'm getting way more than that. Anything else here? Good. Okay. Moving on. Here either. Okay. Hello. None shall pass by. Let those who would disturb her sleep fall into the depths of endless darkness. I think you'd never find the key to this door.
Come here. Dark bones. That's a dark bones. It's the baddest of the bones gang. Maxis P is trying to attack five defenses too. When its HP goes down to zero, it collapses into a pub, but eventually rise again. Fire and explosions will opponent enter it getting back up though. If HP is high, it's hard to take it down. Like any other bones, it sometimes builds friends if it feels outnumbered. If it's a pretty tough enemy, you better take it and its buddies out all at once. Oh, good. Brings all the audience back, right? Yeah. Let's give it a little kiss. Right. Okay, let's go again. Palace key. Key for a door in the Palace of Shadow. Bonk. An ultra shroom. I do want that. Hell yeah. Go to this Mr. Softener. I'm never going to use it. Never, ever. Okay, another two, two star points for me. <laughs> Wonderful. Almost leveled up though, so worth it. Now let's see if you have anything else in you. I know that you, on your own, don't care, but... Eight more fights to go at the worst. If I just use that on Goombella... more to go. Alright. Another save point. Wonderful. Let me just fight these guys first. Five more to go. Star point in the pocket. We get a P up, P down, P badge, which I don't think I already had. I'm missing one badge, which might be P down, D up, P. Which I think is also here somewhere. I used a dizzy dial. Right. I know where I want to get to, so I'm going to keep going again. If I remember right, this is the one where you've got to go where the torches are, not where the torches aren't.
you know, the bottom one's like extinguished, so you gotta go to the top one. Then you've gotta go back because the left one's lit now. You'd think you're just going in circles, but you're really not. I see it wants me to go straight back in where I came from. So I will. Then it wants me to go down. I think Umbella tells you what to do if you're not sure. This is where I want it to be. We get out of one room just to find another one. It's huge. I mean, it's like an underground city, right? What is this place? The chomps should still be worth something, so I should fight them. Okay, they actually are still worth three, and now they'll probably be worth two, but that's fine. We leveled up. And I would like to do something risky, because I don't know any better. Give myself some BP. I think this makes sense. Maybe it doesn't, and I'm an idiot, but I think it does. Mario became a superstar next, but Mario's crowd of stages to get even bigger. I'm level 30, but I think you can level up beyond level 30. What I want. All or nothing is good. But I think I want P up, D down. More. If I take charge off... My thinking is, I've got two defend pluses on. If I put two power up defense downs on, does that just counteract the two defense pluses, but I still get the two power up? Which means it's like a net. Like, it's a wash, but now I do seven damage a hit with a jump. Meaning anything with less than 14 health and zero defense just dies when I touch it. Because that would be pretty cool. How? Okay, so now I take three. That makes sense. But now I should be able to hurt you guys. And I can. Now if I defend, will a crate hammer do six? Great camera doing six damage to all enemies with ignores defenses is very good. Yeah, I'll just use that on myself. No problem. Right. Okay. That's good to know. So we'll try that for a bit. Maybe it's a mistake. I certainly won't be doing it for the uh, super bosses and things, but. Give it a go. Let me just open this path up. Bonk. Can't do anything with this yet, but 
one day. Now, so basically I'm taking normal damage again. Like, what, what damage is the game expects you to be taking at this point? But I'm doing way more damage than I'm expected to do. So that's good. Uh, anyway, I'll see you guys next time when we carry on with this part of the level. And don't play for an hour, only play for half an hour. <laughs> see you then. Goodbye.